Have you ever experienced unexpected spitting from your airbrush? Today, we're gonna to talk about what causes that, how to avoid it. And the good news is, is I can almost guarantee you, you won't have to buy anything to solve it. I'm Warwick from Harder and Steenbeck, and this video is part of our Need to Know Basics series. The cause of spitting 90% of the time is when you have a little bit of moisture that's present in your airline and it finds its way up to the airbrush and spits out the end. It's usually pretty catastrophic to the work, so it is something that you really want to avoid. Now, most compressors that you can buy nowadays come with a moisture filter on the compressor itself. I would argue that if it doesn't come with that, you might want to rethink whether you want that compressor. That moisture filter should take out all of the moisture in the air at the temperature that the air is running through well enough that you don't ever experience any moisture dropping out of the airline. And by and large, that's exactly what they do. However, what a lot of folks do is when they've finished painting for the day, they clean up, they switch off, and they leave it connected. Now, if you leave your hose connected at both ends overnight, that warm air that's got a little bit of moisture as humidity in the air, as it cools down, that moisture will drop out as liquid in your air hose and it'll be waiting for you the next time you come to airbrush to surprise you just when you could do with it the least. It won't happen right at the start of your session because it'll take a little bit of time to work its way up the hose before it comes out the front of your airbrush, quite possibly when you're at the most critical part of the work. So how to avoid it? It's super simple. All you do is once you're done for the day, disconnect your hose at both ends just hang it up over a door or a chair so that both ends are pointing down. That way you'll get air circulating through the hose. You get fresh air going in there, it can cool off and that moisture is not gonna drop out in the hose at all. And I can almost guarantee that you'll never experience the problem again if you just follow that simple rule. Disconnect your air hose at both ends every night and hang it over the back of the chair that you sit in. I hope that was helpful. I know it really helped me a lot when I figured it out and saved me a lot of heartache in my airbrushing. So please do like and subscribe to our channel and then you'll get more of our need to know basics that hopefully are gonna help you to have more fun with your airbrushing.